It's a 10,000 square foot floor in this building open to the unhoused and migrants. PR director Suzanne Morris of the Unitarian Universalist Association says, there's a number of commercial real estate properties that have vacant space currently, and we wanted to show that this can be done. But Cindy Fishman doesn't think it's a good idea. I personally look at it as a home for illegals, not migrants. A lot of our resources are going to them rather than Americans. BU professor Tom Byrne, who specializes in housing, says he understands why not everyone is on board. People who are in need of emergency shelter for whatever the reason are a highly stigmatized population and there's a perception that there's something bad and dangerous about having um, a shelter in, in one's neighborhood. The Unitarian Universalist Association says that the shelter will house up to 25 families with children. The governor's office says that the shelter will be open until the start of June and that they are working with United Way to fund the shelter. United Way and the governor's office did not respond to confirm the statement. This is Joanna Malvis reporting with BUTV10.